My name is Jim Hami. I'm a Mayo uh, Clinic pediatric emergency physician, and I'm going to talk to you about a recent article that we published on uh, decreasing CT scans uh, in uh, pediatric appendicitis. Sort of the genesis of this study was uh, one where we were looking at a big kind of heterogeneous population of kids coming in with abdominal pain. On that list of possibilities with a, was appendicitis for many of them. And as we would try to figure out who did and who did not have appendicitis, it seemed as though there was this push towards diagnostic certainty. We had this tool, the CT scan, that could really visualize the appendix and tell you, yep, it's inflamed or enlarged or not. But the problem was that tool wasn't risk-free. It often involved putting an IV in, uh, IV contrast, and radiation exposure. And many of us felt that we could make that diagnosis quite well clinically or sometimes with the utilization of ultrasound. The problem though with ultrasound was it wasn't as sensitive. It didn't pick up as much uh, of the uh, appendici appendicitis as uh, the CT scan. So there was some desire to say, just skip the ultrasound and go to the CT scan. But the ultrasound was a safe, non-ionizing way of looking for things. And so prior to developing this algorithm that we published in the paper, we looked at that and found that our ultrasound rates were about 60% of the time helpful and about 40% of the time not helpful. But in the other 40% of the time, using some other diagnostic tools, such as our just clinical gestalt, we could sort of sort out who should and who should not then go on to get a CT scan, be admitted to the hospital, or go home. And what we found is that though the ones we sent home, none of them came back with appendicitis. So that was kind of the genesis of developing this uh, multidisciplinary algorithm with the pediatric surgeons and the radiologist, where we help kind of guide the evaluation of the patients with suspected appendicitis down pathways. And what we were able to accomplish by doing this was we decreased the CT scan rates by 50%, uh, and we did not increase the negative appendectomy rates. And what that means is we didn't take out a whole bunch of normal appendix uh, uh, as a result. And so it was really very helpful uh, multidisciplinary approach at decreasing utilization of a resource in CT scans that was very helpful but also had some risks such as ionizing radiation and cost, but not increasing the risk to patients. Uh, and that's where I think the real benefit from this study comes.